Good morning. I hope everybody's having a wonderful start to the weekend. I have switched my hot coffee this morning for iced coffee. <laughs> and this is totally not product placement, but I gotta tell you, if you love cold brew, uh, there's a coffee bean um, company, I don't know, a, they sell coffee beans, I think you can probably get it ground, but it's called Passport and they have the most amazing cold brew. So if you are like me and you love your cold brew, give it a try. What I wanted to talk with you about uh, today is some really cool tools that have totally helped me with my productivity and just allowed me to have more fun with my business. And they're super inexpensive. Some of them are free or have a free version. <coughs> Excuse me. Great, right? I'm coughing because uh, there's no redos on this the series. <laughs> so I have my little notes I'm going to share with you and I'll put links in the comments as well on these tools that I feel like have been just a game changer for me and I hope they help you too. So the first one is Canva. If you are creating graphics for social media, for your website, for promotions, and if you're an entrepreneur, chances are you're doing that. Canva is an amazing tool. It is $120 a year, super easy to use. There's also a free version, so I should say that first. You can totally use it for free. I did for probably the first six months, and then I got used to it, and I thought, oh, I kind of want these other features. <laughs> but it's $120 a year. You can import your pictures. They've just upgraded the platform, so once you buy uh, the yearly subscription, you get all of the elements at no additional cost. So we use it for producing our, our quarterly newsletter, our social media banners, our Pinterest pins, um, promotions, all kinds of things. It's a super cool tool. And uh, you can go to like Creative Marketplace or some other places and buy some really nice templates at just a super low price. Well, maybe like 20 bucks and you get like, you know, 30 templates. So you really can't beat it. Uh, and then when you buy the paid version, you can include your brand colors too. It's super easy to change that. So that Canva, if you haven't used that, that's a great one. Another one is Calendly. So Calendly is a scheduler. It does have a free version. I pay for it every year. It's $96 and you can go in and set up different meetings. Uh, so like 30 minute meetings, an hour meeting, you can indicate whether it's in person or over the phone and then you fill out your availability and you can send a link to people and they go in and sign up, you know, uh, for a coffee chat or a consulting call or whatever it is um, that you meeting that you want to create with them and the cool thing about Calendly is it automatically adjusts for time zones I'm terrible at that <laughs> I've missed more than one meeting because I messed up the time zone and it, so it does it for you and they just go in click fill it out and you're good to go I think the only downside for Calendly and maybe it has this functionality I haven't if it's there I haven't figured it out yet is that when somebody schedules time you have to actually go in and block that time out from being available like it won't automatically do that for you but it's a great tool um, another one and this one is completely free is Google Analytics I'm sure again there's paid versions but I only started using this a couple months ago and it's really cool because you can put code in your website and it will track your audience your bounce rate you know um, attributes like is it men is it women what are they searching for and they have some really nice tutorials that you can go through that are also free. So I'm just starting to use it and it's really, first right now it's interesting, later it'll drive my decisions. Uh, you can set up goals, there's just all kinds of stuff. So that's Google Analytics. And then Webinar Jam. So this is the most expensive tool uh, that I have in terms of recommendations. So Webinar Jam is, it's a software for webinars. And um, I looked at a couple of different options. It's got some limitations. What I like about Webinar Jam is it's really easy to use. You can customize your landing pages. Uh, it's very professional looking and the experience feels really good when you're hosting a webinar. Um, the, the drag about it or the one downside I would say is when you're speaking online, there's about a 15 to 25 second delay between when you're talking and they hear it. Now it doesn't mess up the experience of the webinar because the slide flips, you talk, they just see that about 15 to 20 seconds later. 
Where it gets weird is if you ask a question and you're waiting to see responses show up in the chat, it's gonna have a lag. And then the other thing that you can do with Webinar Jam is bring people on camera. So if they have questions, you can actually, they can ask to come on camera and then it's live. Like it, there's not that, that awkward pause. It's got some nice analytics on the back end, but I think that could be a little bit more robust. The other thing that's cool about it is you can get up to 500 users online for the $500 and all the other platforms are so much more expensive than that. And it doesn't work, I'd say, great for any other purpose, although I am using it for my online masterclass to do a Q&A every Friday and it seems to be working well for that. So Webinar Jam, $500. And then the last one, this is just a fun one. It's called Video Boost. And it's an app, you can't do it online. You can only access it through the app on your phone. And um, you can create these really cool videos. They have this template inside. So you use your phone, you pick the theme that you want, and then you type in what you want it to say. You can pick music in the background, you can add your pictures, and it looks like, a, I mean, it's commercial. And it's super cool. It's, like I said, easy to do. You can upload it to your social media platforms. And that one is, I think, $110 a year. This is kind of weird. Or you can buy a lifetime access for $140. So if you're gonna use it more than a year, just get the lifetime access. Um, and then it, you can't, because you can't use it on the computer, you can only upload it to your social media from your phone. Uh, but it is a great tool. My, um, Janice, my, Executive assistant uses it all the time to create little videos. So if you want to check out what that looks like, you can go to uh, Janice's page, Janice Swanson, S-W-A-N-S-O-N, or my page and take a look. And I'll put a link in the comments for one of the videos we created using Video Boost so you can kind of get a feel for what it's like. And I think you can do a seven day trial for free on that one too. So those are just a handful of really cool apps that when I started my business, like two th the end of beginning of 2017 oh my gosh i would love to have known those things existed and i'm sure there's a lot of other cool things out there that are I, i've yet to discover so if you have um, a tool that you use that you love i'd love to hear about it in the comments and um, yeah let's get the thread going so that we can help each other find those amazing tools that are out there hope you guys have a wonderful day and i will see you tomorrow Bye.